How, how do you feel about being in the position you're in now going into these final three games? We feel real good. We know uh, we're building something, we're building something special here at Georgia Tech, even though we're not, um, we're not eligible for a bowl game. But we, we know we keep on, keep on striving to, to attack greatness, trying to get greatness. So how much trash talk is there with your brother this week? It's a lot. Yeah, we got we got a little uh, a little competition going on in the house. So yeah, it's it's gonna be fun. I saw you made like some graphics or something on Twitter. Does he make those or does he get somebody else to make those? No, nah, my my dad got uh my dad got um somebody to make it and it's gonna be like they wearing a shirt. Like the whole okay. family gonna have it on the shirt, yeah. So you're not gonna wear like two thirds Georgia Tech and a Third Virginia Tech jersey. <laughs> it's, gonna, it's gonna be cut in half. One side gonna be uh, Virginia Tech. One side gonna be Georgia Tech. So yeah. What does that kind of mean to your family to kind of have almost everybody there? Yeah, it's it's gonna be a good one. I, I like like they told me they were gonna be like 50 deep here. So yeah. <laughs> so I'm glad it, it'll be good to see all the family here. So it just give me more motivation to go hard. Yeah. Take some bragging rights over your little brother that you scored a touchdown before you did. <laughs> no, nah, I, no, nah, I don't. I won't pick at him because I already know his time coming. I mean, um, I already know he's gonna have way more touchdowns than me. So I just stay home, just be quiet. <laughs> you know, you're sad when they call, like they called that he scored, but they called it back. Remember in the Miami game? Like I imagine that was kind of would have been special if you both scored in the same game. Yeah, yeah. I was, I was happy when it first, when it initially happened, but when they called it back, I was like, oh, your time coming though. Just keep on grinding. Just keep grinding. So yeah. So what do you think you've improved on the most throughout the season to, to get the, the added reps that you're getting now? Um, my technique. Yeah, at the beginning of the season, uh, I was kind of iffy on my technique. And then uh, going out and practice every day, just grinding and grinding. And then they, they finally trusted me to get more reps. So I'm excited. I'm glad, I'm glad that I could do that. Can you describe what it was like playing with your brothers like, in the backyard growing up? In the backyard. Well, yeah, we used to uh, we used to always have like we one time we wanted to have a neighborhood neighborhood team to go like a football team just to go around each neighborhood and play. Uh, but we used to always be competitive. It don't matter if we was going against each other or playing with each other. We always used to uh, beat up on the other kids that that wasn't in our household. <laughs> so yeah, it was it was cool. I wish we can go back and do that again. I think I remember you coach at Rome was saying, and I think remember what Mike was saying, is that like when you guys were Rome, he was the only one on offense. So mm -hmm. the three of you against him in practice, I guess. Yeah. What, what would, I mean, and then like, the, and you come home and talk about who got who or. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, Jamai, Jamai is one thing y'all learned by him. He he's one competitive dude, especially when it comes to family members. He always he wanted to be. Well, he think his, his nickname, where his middle name is King, and he always hold that over our head, saying he's the best one or whatever. So every time we go to practice, we gotta we gotta we always trying to get him. You know what I'm saying? So it's always us against him because he got the he got the big mouth. So we just gotta shut him up. <laughs> yeah. And how's your teammate? So he's gotta. Yeah. <laughs> what, what, so is there something on the line, like as far as when you get home or Thanksgiving or whatever, that, that there's some sort of wager between you and? It's no wagering. No. What what's it talking like? What are you guys saying like for? Just a lot of hype. Um, just a lot of hype about how we're gonna do good in this game and who can uh. Who can just outplay each other, just just like that, like uh, Jamias. We always set goals for Jamias to uh, just every time he get the ball, just just gain just gain yards. Don't 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 try to um, don't lose yards in the play. So just being positive, we just try to like just go hard on each other. So that's all it is. Just competitiveness and love at the end of the day. So. What do you guys mean for your I mean, I haven't seen a tweet about it. Oh, yeah. I know. I know he's proud of us. And that's that's all we want. We just want, because uh, ever since we was little, he uh, he um, just trained us up. Like, one day, we didn't even know. Like, we just he, he just trained us, trained us until we was little. And now now that we see the big picture, we just forever grateful for him um, for doing that. So, yeah. Anything else for Jaquan? All right, thanks, Jaquan. Appreciate it. Thank you.